live vibes today in the high country. What could I say? So I'm actually back to reading again. Since the daily vlog is no longer, I can sleep and I can wake up at a good time and I can read books at night. So anyway, I've been getting into some chant and lo-fi, lo-fi combo music when I'm reading anyway. So I, I thought, you know what, let's throw some lo lo-fi on the vlog today. All right, that was Mount Chavano, beautiful up there as always, of course. Man, there's just so many spots in the United States, in the world, but in Colorado where it's just like, man, I've never been on some of these trails actually today. So I had the FKT on the old trail for a while, but then the old trail was no dice. It was not constructed well. So they've added, a, they're actually doing this on quite a few 14ers in Colorado right now where they're adding switchbacks to make it more sustainable, which is smart because, you know, if you go straight up the mountain, there's gonna be erosion, there's gonna be uh, not rock slides, but like water running down the trails. So they built a new trail last summer. So I hadn't seen it before. So I thought, you know what, today's, today's the day to celebrate the mountains and go see this new trail. And speaking of celebrate, um, I just think that as runners, like keep celebrating your little victories, big and small, in training and racing, foam rolling and recovery, uh, not PRing, not getting FKTs, celebrate it still. Because guess what? You're putting yourself out there. And today I will confirm, I believe we got it. I'll confirm once we get back to the house. Uh, but I believe we snagged the new one on the new trail. But it's like, don't hesitate. Like this gift that we have as runners to celebrate those little victories, no matter what you're chasing down, no matter what you're tra training for, whether it's the track, whether it's the road, whether it's the ultras, whether it's the mountains, uh, because it is bizarre. It's, uh, I had my 20th high school reunion last weekend in BV, and basically everybody came up to me and made the joke, like, did you run here, Seth? And it's like, I love the fact that that's the first thing they ask me when I go up to give them a big hug because I haven't seen them in 15, 20 years. And they, you know, they made the joke, like, did you run up from Denver? Uh, but no, I did not, uh, I drove. But anyway, it's like celebrate those little moments in your journey as a runner. So that's what, like, when I go run fast in the mountains, yes, yes, it's kind of, it's fun to chase down times, but more importantly, it's, it's a celebration of life. And the fact that these old billy goat legs can still do this, because time waits for no man as you well know. So anyway, when was the last time, question of the day, when was the last time you had a little celebration for something connected to your running? I hope it was recent, all right? Because we gotta do it more often, because life's too short. We gotta celebrate these little things. Onward we go, lo-fi vibes on the way out. See you guys on another mountain very, very soon. We'll toss it to the mountain running playlist everybody all right see beauty work hard love each other